Right, I'm going to show you how to use the ladder method to do 342 multiplied by 7. So the first thing we have to do is rewrite our calculation in column format. That's 342 multiplied by 7. Now, just as in the grid method, we have to partition our 342. We do this down the side here. So we've got 7 times our units. So we've got 2 units. And we do 7 times the tens. So we've got 4 tens, or 40. And then we've got 7 times 3 hundreds, or 300. Now, we multiply our brackets, our partitions, or products. So now we've got the first one, 7 times 2 is 14. And we've got to be careful that we get our tens in the tens column, units in the units column, hundreds, and any thousands. So we've got to make sure we put our products in the correct place value columns. So the next one is 7 times 40. So it's a multiple of 10, 40 is a multiple of 10, so 7 times 4 is 28. So use our times tables knowledge, and then we just turn that back into a multiple of 10. So it'll be 280. Next one is 7 times 300, and this is a multiple of 100. So 7 times 3, again using our times table knowledge, is 21. So we turn that back into a multiple of 100 by adding two zeros onto the end. That becomes 2,100. So now we've worked out our partitions. So now we've got to add up our answers. So a units column is a 4, tens column, 9, hundreds column, 3, and the thousands column, 2. So the answer to 342 multiplied by 7 is 2,394.